These are the worst 10 GameCube games I found on the internet. And we're starting off with Aquaman. This game has the most unengaging story I've ever played. The effort in making this game was zero to none. The cutscenes are just images of comic strips with no sound or voice acting. Boring. The gameplay? What the f was that? You start off with Aquaman's brother ready to do some evil things by blowing up Atlantis. And then they're like, we gotta do something about this. And then he goes, and then the horrible gameplay begins. The combat system in this game is lame. There's no tutorial on how to play, and I didn't even know you can spawn in a- What in the hell is happening? The best part of this game is the swimming and getting beat up. Although this game seems bad, another GameCube game that is worse is Jimmy Neutron Attack of the Twonkies. Our protagonist Jimmy Neutron wants to go to Planet Twonkis 3. Well, I have to get back to my lab and make preparations for my trip to Twonkis 3. Twonkis 3? Carl, I have a date with Twonkis 3. Twonkis 3? With no space helmet as he lands on Twonkis 3 with no jacket on... What? Anyways, he starts to collect some minerals for his experiments while a gromp attacks his ship. Yes, this is a gromp. He somehow escapes and goes back to school, bringing the minerals with him. Why is there a soft, squishy thing digging itself out of that tank of stuff? It might be dangerous. Dangerous. <laughs> I wonder what his children sounds like. Never mind. <laughs> the gameplay? Oh, Jimmy's dating a comet and I have to go sniff animals. Despite this being one of the worst GameCube games, another GameCube game that is worse is Space Raiders. The storyline is aliens falling from the sky and invading Earth. That's it. That's the storyline. I should have never played this game, and I'm gonna show you why. This is the gameplay? The gameplay is just one button. Yeah, you got your roll, you got your grenades, but majority of the time, you're just spamming one button. Useless game. But you know what's more useless than Space Raiders? Monster Inc. Scream Arena. There are monsters in corporate. A simple dodgeball game that is super repetitive and nothing about this game is fun. Hold the glowing green ball the longest and win. I won. It was so boring that I rage quit. Yeah, this is not fun. I can't play this. It's just fucking dodgeball. Spyro entered the dragonfly. Stupidest game ever. Wow! Why is this the beginning of the game? The antagonist, Ripto, wants the dragonflies because the dragonflies are stronger than the dragons. This is stronger than that? Okay. So he takes them. Spyro! That little lizard totally stole all the dragonflies. Even Sparks is gone. Yeah, no sh Sparks! I thought I lost you, pal. How do you survive? That was close, Sparks. Wait, 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 wait. You understand him. You understand him. The question is... Do I understand him? I don't. Maybe because he doesn't fucking speak English and he talks Dragonfly. Anyways, the game has nothing to offer. Low time takes forever and this 15 second gameplay is basically the game and it's boring. Bad Boys Miami Takedown. Crappy controls and the camera view is weird. It can't be that bad. Yeah, I don't, I don't see this camera view. It's not, it's not bad. Holy shit, it's bad. GameCube controller and shooting, they don't go together. You know what else doesn't go together? Shrek Extra Large. That's Shrek? Why do you look like that? Wait. I want the cookies. Close to the bridge, two funny looking kids wanted to get across. Those are not kids. They're adults. Cookies. What, what the f? Okay, all right, you don't have to be pushing. What are you- what are you doing? This platforming is trash. Damn, this- You got- You know what's more trash and unplayable? 
Batman Dark Tomorrow. Oh. It's Batman. Ain't no fing way. I gotta handcuff them after I beat them. You gotta be kidding me. That is such an ugly animation. I have to do that each building? Dude, this game. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, is it even worth showing? Charlie Angels, the weirdest storyline out of all of them. The characters are Natalie, Dylan, and Alex. Get ready. Cause you're about to hear the dumbest story. There's a blackout in New York City. And these thieves, they took the Statue of Liberty. Also, they took other monuments. I have no idea how you steal these. This dude wants the Charlie Angels to go to a cargo ship and join a bikini contest to hide the fact that they're totally spies. This is so much attention. They're fighting in bikinis. The fighting is repetitive. The animation is clunky stupid and it's stupid it's stupid by far the worst game in the universe everything is bad there's a ladder that takes almost one minute to climb i don't remember this ladder what is this ladder peak gameplay right here this is actually the peak of the peak is oh sorry that was by accident they got the nokia on deck though mm. 